Hey, what's up, Pop Hearts TV? Heather Joy Smith here, and today I am joined by Ryan Buggle. He is a 13-year-old, and he stars on Law & Order SBU with Mariska Hargitay and Ice Cube. Welcome, Ryan. Hi, how are you? Thank you so much for having me. Of course. I'm so happy to have you join us. Um, first off, I got to say, you at such a young age at 13 have already accomplished so much. So I'm really, really impressed with you. Thank and you. I'm excited to chat with you more today. Um, I want to get into kind of how you got into acting because I know you've been acting since you were basically born practically. Yes. Um, three years old, I, I heard you had a Toys R Us commercial and you got the acting bug from that commercial. Can you tell me a little bit about what made you want to go into it after that? Well, when I did the Toys R Us commercial, I just loved like the lights, the camera, and the unlimited amount of snacks sealed the deal. <laughs> you know what's funny is I saw your Instagram and all the crafty things on there that you're like, yeah. I gotta have my snacks from craft services. <laughs> so <laughs> that checks out. <laughs> Everyone loves a good craft snack every now and then. <laughs> and you play Olivia Benson's son on the show, Law and Order SVU. And I got to tell you real quick, my dog is actually named after Olivia Benson. So, is, yeah. So cool. <laughs> yeah, so that's super fun. Um, you've been on the show for quite a while now. What has been some of your most memorable moments so far on um, the show? Um, well, I do have a really exciting memory with Mariska. She is like the coolest person ever, but she also knows the coolest people and she invited me to Neil Patrick Harris's um party and his kids are so cool and there's a giant slide from the top of his house all the way to the bottom and it was just so much fun going down the slide a billion times I just love her so much that's amazing and a really good fact yeah. about his house that's so cool <laughs> um what have you learned from being on set all these years and working with such accomplished actors uh, I have learned to always um act with your heart and always make it come from a real natural place. Absolutely. And you've had some really, really intense and hard scenes to do over the years too, but also have been really, I think, needed for people to see um, that are watching the show. So for you, how do you get into character when you have a really intense scene that you have to do? Well, I just think about what Snow would, would like because I've known him for so long. Yeah. I just think what he would do and I just use my heart and my act like that. Yeah. Do you feel like because you've played Noah for so long that like you sometimes like off camera will be like him or something like that? <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> and I know you, you had, um, a, a scene a couple see I think it was last season maybe um yeah. where you were bullied and your character came out as bisexual can you tell me a little bit about that and what that was like yes so um for the bullying scene a fun fact the like the character who was the bully is actually really nice so he's a really okay. good actor <laughs> and second of all if you um are bullied just don't be afraid to tell a trusted adult and always be true to yourself Absolutely. And that scene where he came out, um, I honestly don't have any words to explain how incredible it was. I um I don't have any words. Yeah. But I didn't think I was doing anything amazing when I first did the scene. I just thought that it was amazing for Noah to express who he is and how Olivia Olivia was just um amazing with it. And I'm just so excited for Noah to be that brave. Absolutely. He was very brave and that it's important for other young children to see, you know, it's okay. And, and did you have a lot of people reach out to you after that and, and say like, oh, you helped me? Yes. Um, the reaction was so overwhelming and it was just, a, just so much positive energy. I love it. Um, what were some other challenging scenes or really fun scenes that you've done? Um, I gotta think about that. There's been so many. Yeah. <laughs> um, definitely when a really exciting one was when 
um, I first saw Stabler. There was so many photographers everywhere, and it's just so easy to work with them. Yeah. And I heard that you and Ice Cube like to get down and play little video games while you're waiting on set. <laughs> Who yeah, wins? That's true. <laughs> I gotta be honest, he kind of crushes me a little bit. No way! <laughs> well, we'll practice and, and you'll get there, right? But you also had a amazing Broadway show in 2019 called The Inheritance, which won a Tony for you for best play. Talk about that experience. I mean, that's major. That was so much fun to be in The Inheritance. I loved it so much. If I could do Broadway again, I would definitely do it again because I love the live audience. Yeah. And because you are a, a trained ballet performer too, I'm sure being on stage kind of gives yes. you those feelings again as well. Yeah. Yeah. Talk about um, your your dance background because I know you also had the opportunity to uh, dance with the Radio City Rockets, which is unbelievable. Oh, that was so much fun. I always remember going down, like, when we were in rehearsal, I would always remember going down and seeing all the animals and petting them. Oh. So cool. The the sheep are the best. Oh, that's awesome. Um, What do you like to do? Because you are so, so well-rounded in your career. What do you like doing when you're not working at all? Um, I love to do dance. I just started out in gymnastics. I love skateboarding and singing. Nice. I love that. And I'm so excited for all of the fans out there to continue watching um, Law & Order SVU. It's the 24th season, the longest running show on television right now. So congratulations on all of your success. I can't wait Thank for so us to see what's ahead for Noah on the show. So um, where can everybody find you on social media? They can find me um, at Ryan Buggle. Awesome. Well, thank you, Ryan. It's been a pleasure and we're excited to see you on the show some more. Me too. Thank you so much again. Thank you.